Well, because I'm, nah, I'm not going to say I'm too lazy. I just really don't have the time to clean my bench. I threw a piece of cardboard down. And then what I wanted to show people real quick, I just want to make a quick video. I took the one dummy load I got and I threw it up on here. And I have the piece of coax that comes around right here. RG142 military silver Teflon coax to the bird meter. Come on. I know it'll focus in in a second here. There you go. 1,000 watt. Piece of coax. Come around. No PEP kit. Genuine bird meter. Let me see if I could focus in on that. Genuine bird through line. All right, so we show the coax coming into the amp. Let me focus in here. The relay is bypassed. See this? I unsoldered the relay. So it's just running. Here's the output goes to what I have going on underneath here. And the input comes around through that little piece of coax. There's the piece of coax there. Comes right over and back to the input. Now I put a brand new pair of DEI 2SC 2879s, lot 14-3Q. Okay, and there's the coax. And you'll see I bundled it up because it's kind of a big piece focus. It comes back around here. To my little beater Texas Star one pill. It's got one DEI 2290 in it. If you guys can see that. Make sure that's on. Okay, that's on. And that coax here. Oops. Runs around right over here to my radio. You notice I got everything up here on the cardboard. Oops, don't fall. 200 amp power supply. Now this power supply, I'm going to use the term rigged because I have it rigged to go up to 24 volts. Normally, you know, we don't do that because that blows things up. But this one here is set to where when I crank that dial, this puppy is going to go to the moon. All right, and you can see here, here's the, the power lead. around right over to here the amp meter going right into the two pill so I got my radio driving this bench beater one pill driving two DEI 2879s in the prototype circuit um, thousand watt genuine bird slug genuine bird meter You'll notice here's the power wire coming in Oops, for my radio. So in case anyone wanted to know what that wire is. Now normally the radio is mounted up, you know, I got a bracket for it and the dummy load is down underneath on the floor and this little guy is up in the rack next to the power supplies, the other power supplies I have. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, but I threw it all here on the piece of cardboard just so everything was all together and we can see it's a closed loop system you know from here to here from here to here from here to the dummy load so it's closed loop it's all right here everything is right here on the bench one pill driving two pill DEI 2290 DEI 2879 so, and remember, we're going to be running average. Some people like to call it RMS. We all know that doesn't exist, but it's just a term everybody uses. So, you know, sometimes you got to go with the flow. And, but we're going to be on a regular average reading. You know PEP involved. Now, I'm going to come over here. We're going to start. Oh, and you wanted to see the voltmeter. I started turning it up before I showed you. I mean, the wires come around. I mean, you can see the wires if they're all snaggled up in there, but you'll see it's hooked right to the power strip. And we're going to crank some voltage up here. I think I'm going to set it today at like, I don't know, how about 21? How about 21 and a half? Yeah, it's close enough, 21 and a half. So, and we got the, uh, the amp meter all zeroed in. 
zero. There you go. Uh, and, you know, because the relay is bypassed, you know, the on-off switch at this point doesn't do anything. That's on, on, permanently on. All right. Let's, uh, let's see what this puppy does. Oops. Knock the voltmeter loose there. Okay, we'll go with the watt meter first because that is obviously the most important thing in the world to everybody. Stupid coax is in my way. All right, let's try this. Worldwide, 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 worldwide. So you're seeing we're pumping over 500 watts off of it. Now, let's see what it does on the amp meter here. Worldwide, worldwide, worldwide. Almost 50 amps. Worldwide, worldwide, worldwide. All right, so, you know, it's getting with the program here. Um, it's on high, right? Yep, it's on high. I think that's it. You know, should we, do I need to burn up another transistor for everybody? There we go. 24.6. Let's see what this puppy does. Let's see it get up and get down. Worldwide, 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 worldwide. Hmm. Hmm. Worldwide, 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 worldwide. Now the voltage drops pretty good because these power supplies are not in any way designed to be running at that kind of a voltage. You know, they're really designed around 12 volts, so I'm running them at like double their output. So they drop off quite a bit when you do that. Worldwide, 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 got down. Worldwide, worldwide. Hmm. Let me turn the driver off. Let's see what it does. Radio is pretty hot to begin with. Let's see what it does with just the radio. Worldwide, worldwide. So about 300 with just the radio average power. Turn. Turned it back on. One drive and two. Worldwide, 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 worldwide. Hmm. Let's see. Uh, 5,000 watt slug. I know this is way off then. I won't say way off, but you know what I mean. It's a very little amount of power for such a big slug. But let's just see. So it should be down around here, around 500. Worldwide, 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 worldwide. Oh, there it is. Take that slug out. What else do we have here? This is that coaxial dynamics 2500. Now, you remember me making a video showing that these coaxial dynamics are a little bit whacked, but so that it should be somewhere around here, around 500. Worldwide, 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 worldwide. Okay, get it with that slug. What do we got here? Let me see what else I got laying around. Yeah, this one will be funny. Here's a 250. Now, this is a brand, brand new slug. I just got it, like, I don't know, a week ago or something. There's a uh, 250-watt. This thing's going to pound in the corner. You want to see what in the corner is all about? Worldwide. Worldwide. So, that's a 250. Oops. That's a 100. Ah, that's pretty much all the slugs I got out here on the bench. Put the 1,000 back in. That way we're reading at half scale. 
Worldwide, 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 worldwide. Oh, voltmeter, damn it. There we go. Sorry, got bumped. Worldwide, 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 worldwide. All right, now she is getting hot. Power started to drop off, but admittedly, I'm abusing it well above and beyond what it's supposed to do come on focus in so there you go sorry about burning uh, all this time but uh, let's see how hot it is yeah when you can feel the heat through the aluminum case let me see if I can feel the heat sink oh shit that's freaking hot that is hot Let's see, uh, I should have had this already turned on. Let it boot up here. Curious to see how much, uh, how much heat these little DEIs are producing. It's booting up. I gotta set this down. There we go. I had to focus it. 196 degrees. And some hot stuff right there, buddy. Hot potato. Let's hammer it again. Worldwide, 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 worldwide. Well, you see it's starting to fade a little bit, but let's see what the... Uh Yeah, 285 degrees. Yeah. That's running it pretty hard. I do not recommend this at home. This is just, you know, the way that I test things. This is a small portion of the way that I test things. This is like an end result test. After all the other mathematics have been done, after everything's been figured out on paper, then we go to the experiment phase and blah, 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 and... And you wind up with something like this. So, all right, there it is, all together on one piece of cardboard. Yeah. Yeah. Worldwide, 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 worldwide. Worldwide, worldwide, worldwide. Sorry for burning up this much of your time, everybody. Happy 2015. And I hope you enjoy swinging the hammer and keeping them mud ducks running. X-Force. We got it.